<laughs> Alright guys, so it's the very next day. Um, continuing the track prep for Shenny. Yeah, all I need to do now is change the oil in the car and uh, change the brake pads, which I am excited about because this is this is going to be my dedicated track pads that I got from um, Paragon. All right, so here they are. Oh, cool. Whoa, that's sick. So I'm kind of colorblind. Does this look red or orange to you guys? Comment down below. Ooh, that's sick. Sweet. Okay, so. Um, I'm gonna be doing the front pads only because usually most of the stopping power is in the front. Uh, the the rear, you don't really you don't really have to go too crazy on that. So I'm gonna leave my rear uh, pads alone and just change the fronts. So today I'm actually gonna show you guys how to change your front uh, brake pads on your Civic Type R um, and on any brambles. Actually, uh, the the front brambles on the Type R um, is shared with. Um, other cars just like the Evo X I think and some Subis yeah those cars yeah putting on my coveralls that I got from the ship I'm supposed to return them but uh, who wants to use coveralls you know and they're pretty good to use when you're working on your car painting your house doing yard work so I kept them <laughs> Changing out the front pads is really, really easy. So you have these two pins right here. All you gotta do is take off one, take off the other, and then this thing right here should pop out. And once these pop out, you just squeeze this, squeeze the pads in, and it should come off. So this is a special tool that I recently bought from Amazon, and I'll link everything down below. It's this pin right here. So what it does is, uh, it has like a little indent at the tip and it goes like that and you hammer it and the pen should come off, uh, should come out. And so um, I didn't have this before, I, you know, you can tell, you can look closely, the, the pen is kind of like smashed a little bit. Uh, I used a screwdriver and it was kind of sketchy but it did the job, you know, you can do anything. Uh, this one is... Uh, I don't know, I, it took me a while for me to get this because it's kind of pricey, but you know, if you're changing your pads a lot and um, you're going to the track a lot, I recommend getting this. Uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. So I grabbed it, uh, I got it, and so we're gonna uh, knock these guys out and uh, go from there. One out, this one's flaps over like this. So, do the bottom one. This one just slides right out. It's like that. So, this thing comes up. Now, oh, you know what I forgot? <laughs> I forgot to uh, take off the cap of the brake master cylinder. So, all you want to do, take this and pull it towards you. And it should loosen up just like this. So, once you have it out a little bit, just like that, pull it out a little bit and then keep pushing towards you or pulling towards you. Go up a little bit again, pull towards you again, a little bit more towards you again. All right, there you go. That's out. Now I'll do the same thing right here. It's harder. This one is harder because you gotta push with the, like just your thumbs. Uh, the same thing. Push. Uh, wiggle. Push a little more. Uh, wiggle. Uh, 
can also use like something else. More leverage. Ugh. Just like that. Ugh. Oh, so much easier. <laughs> I use the, uh, the end of the hammer. There you go. Boom. A little bit more. And then one more time. That way we have a little peace of mind. Not push anything else. Okay, good. Take it off. I'm good to go. Let's make this one, this side flush, a little bit more. Okay, that seems pretty flush. Oh, okay. Um, they're orange. They look orange or red. I don't know. So here's the new R5 pads by Paragon. Put it in. It should just slip in just like that. There you go. Bam. I'll break this. Okay. Slap those in just like that. Right. Slap this in. Just like that. Make sure this part right here, see, it's pressing down just like that, okay? Boom, and this one should boom. Okay, now I'm just gonna line it up. Yeah. All right, just like that. That's it, that's how you change the front brake pads. And uh, it's gonna be the same on the other side and I'm not gonna film that part, so yeah. So, changing the oil, make sure you take this off. Jack up the car, obviously, and secure it. Yeah.